can tell it's a cheap guitar, some rough blooming woodwork going on in there. I was about to saw, hmm, how'd I get the nut off then? Let's Google it. And it's pushed on it. it fell off. Oh, so pick up out and then I uh, can clean it. I was watching Jamie Slade do a show on the other day on string changing and in between string changing he did something I've never done. And that's cleaner guitar. <laughs> I've actually never done it. I just think, you know, it was a part of Mark applied and get old. Or dusty, see so you the finger finger marks on the fretboard where you play and where you don't play. Yeah, so far I don't know. I bought some stuff. Some done lot of stuff. And I'll um, give it a team. Doesn't that look nice? <laughs> yeah. Pretty shiny, shiny, shiny green guitar. <sighs> All right, what time is it? Got pick, pick up some children from school. Right, I shall leave it there today. Go back again. Well, this is the end of the video. I just realised it. Bye bye. Here's a lesson in life for you. Always check the contents of something you ordered. I have seven machine heads, lovely. I only have six of the inserts, six washers and six screws in which to fasten them down with. So while I'm here, I'll fit six of the machine heads. I just contacted the company and said, hello, can I have another insert, another washer, another screw, please? I'm sure they'll send that ASAP. I can see the mix up. Six is normal, I forgot to, um, amend the basket for seven. Cheeky. All right, let's fit some machine heads. <laughs> Having just messaged the company, I realized one of them has got the um, insert on the machine head. No behold, there's another screw line around here. <laughs> Not sure you can see that on the camera. Nice focus on the The screwdriver's just lost a chunk of itself. It's not long for this world. I should go find another screwdriver. Proper screwdriver. Driver number three. This one. Who knows how tight to put these? I'm doing it as tight until you hear this hear the wood squash, the old crack. Crack of wood? Or it's a little creak. I'll be tight enough then. Very good. When you graphite nut, sit there. Not going to do that yet. I'll do that. See me? Hello. When I put the strings on, the strings that hold it in place while it glues. 
Now I'm just positioning the bridge. Oh, the camera's so high up. Oh, low down. No, no. There we go. I'm gonna make sure I get all oh, the holes in line, get the bridge in line, the tape. The sitting. Oh, voila! Alright, what's the map? Let's see what the holes are. Ah, there's some tape on it. Your holes. What I'm doing now, I'm scraping off some of the um, surface finish from the new bridge so that when I fit it, the earthing point will have a nice bit of contact to um, earth two with a bare metal. There, I should do it. Nice shiny patch back of there, sits on top of that. Let's the metal over there. You've got light in it, it's quite dark. Oh, I've got two lights on, mate. It's quite dark in the studio, Bill. Let's get that something. Good job. Yeah, not qualified to do, but yeah. it's a work for me. I'm a mechanical technician by trade. I don't really do electrics. Hence, diagrams and different stuff. Jackson Nazgul, seven string monster. There it is. That's it. With a hip shot copy, bridge, not a real hip shot. Nazgul, obviously, Seymour Duncan Nazgul. Sounds brilliant. Unbranded locking tuners from Amazon. Seems to be working well. I've uh, been playing it for half an hour. I haven't just tuned it, obviously, stretched the strings in a little while tuning and setting up the intonation. And, um, yeah, fine. Holding. Absolutely brilliant. The nut. Feels nice. I think I've got a nice sustain, nice quality tone coming out of this. Much better than before. And, um, yeah. As ever, I forgot to record or well, film myself playing the original pickup. I'm not putting it back in just to make a video. I have to imagine what it looks like. 
Uh, EQ wise for the guitar tones, obviously a cut around 5000, give it that annoying <coughs> from the guitar tone. And a little bit of compression, just for giggles, that's in both guitars. The FS EQ is flat, absolutely flat, just to get rid of that annoying little sound. And that's it. So, there you go. Hope you enjoyed it. Come back for more. I say more of this, I've got no plans to modify any more guitars for the time being. But more reactions, more covers, more playthroughs, more now disconnect information. And we'll see you soon. <laughs>